New at five, a bizarre case in Dunwoody that even has the police department baffled. A man wielding a bat runs to a home in the middle of the night and starts smashing the windows. Now, thanks to a homeowner's ring doorbell, the whole thing was cop captured on camera. Fox 5's Patty Penn joins us live with the story tonight. Patty, we understand that this is pretty good video, right? Yeah, I got to say this video is pretty clear and that's why the police department, they believe someone out there definitely knows who this individual is. Police tonight, they have a lot of questions why anyone would do something like this if this was random and if this house was targeted. It's really hard, dude. And with that comment, apparently to a buddy standing around the corner, a ring doorbell captures <coughs> the destruction that follows. <laughs> A man armed with a baseball bat goes at it. First, he takes aim at the front door handle, next a window, and then another. In all, police say he smashed out four windows at this home in the Winter Hall subdivision off Shambly Dunwoody Road. It happened early Sunday morning. Officers were dispatched to what was believed to have been a burglary in progress on Winter Hall Lane. Uh, the 911 caller heard glass breaking and thought someone's house was being broken into. Dunwoody Police Sergeant Robert Parsons tells Fox 5 they need to find this person and find him fast. They want to know if this was random or if this was a targeted attack. We don't know why we don't know what led up to this. Um, it certainly is, seems to be a random incident, but we want to find this person to find out you know, why they did what they did. In fact, the fear now is this individual could do this again. That's why police have taken this case very seriously and allocated a lot of their resources to finding this individual. This was a, a just a brazen act. I mean, to go up to someone's porch in the middle of the night like that. I mean, the, the homeowners could have come out armed. A neighbor could have seen what was going on and intervened as well. I mean, it certainly could have ended tragically uh, for many people involved. Here's another look at the individual police are looking to identify. He's being uh, described as being a white man in his late teens to early 20s. He was wearing dark aviator sunglasses and a leather jacket. We've also learned that he and another individual apparently left the scene in a dark colored SUV. 